Hi, Caterpillars. Um, the snow that we had a couple days ago made me think of this one story that I have about a rabbit who builds something in the snow. And uh, let's see. It's called the mouse that Jack built. So he made a mouse out of the snow. Out of the snow. And the story is by Cindy Zerkeries. Okay. We're going to see this somewhere in the story. Let's see if you can find it. There he is, rolling the ball to start out his snow mouse. This is the mouse that Jack built. This is the raisin used for the nose on the face of the mouse that Jack built. You see the reason? Oh, what do we see down here? Two little mice making what? Their own. These are the whiskers that wiggled and twitched, causing poor Jack to giggle and itch. Put next to the raisin used for the nose on the face of the mouse that Jack built. There's the two sticks that he used for the Whiskers. And oh, look at that. He's getting tickled and itched. There's the mice making their own <gasps> snow something. Jack used his hat, all tattered and torn. <gasps> Where did we see this? Along with his scarf, all tattered and torn. It just means they're kind of old and ratty, kind of used up. Hmm. One set on the head, one wrapped around the neck. Brush free of snowflakes, every speck. Below the whiskers that wiggled and twitched, causing poor Jack to giggle and itch. Put next to the raisin used for the nose on the face of the mouse that Jack built. So, there's the hat on the head. There's the scarf. Below the whiskers. And there's the raisin used for the nose. Mom called him with a scold. Jack, come home. Your supper's cold. What does she have in her pockets? We'll see those again in the story later, too. Now wear your hat, though it's ragged and worn. She put on his scarf, all tattered and torn. There's the mice back there, still working, I think. One had, one had sat on the head, one had wrapped around the neck, brushed free of snowflakes every speck. Below the whiskers that wiggled and twitched, causing poor Jack to giggle and itch. Put next to the raisin used for the nose on the face of the mouse that Jack built. Look, they made one. What did they make? They made a rabbit. What do you think they're going to make with these? I wonder. This is Jack. He went home. <laughs> what are they doing there with his, like with his tongue? And what are those mice doing? Oh my goodness. Ate his supper and went to bed. Let's see if he wore all the necessary things for outside. I see his coat, his scarf, his hat, his boots. Hmm. He wore mittens too, I think. See them. Early the next day, Mama finished a new scarf and hat. She sent Jack out with a hug and a pat. Look, he's got a new hat and scarf. What did she use to make that, that scarf and hat? Hmm. With his old hat all ragged and worn, and that old scarf all tattered and torn, to put back on the mouse that Jack built. Look at what those mice did. They made a lot of snow bunnies. Let's count them. Use your finger to help me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. They were some busy, busy mice, weren't they? Well, I really liked that story. I hope you did too. See you later. Bye.